free physics mp3 from cg4u.net for students source, Wikipedia. Hilbert space The mathematical concept of a Hilbert space, named after David Hilbert, generalizes the notion of Euclidean space. It extends the methods of vector algebra and calculus from the two-dimensional Euclidean plane and three-dimensional space to spaces with any finite or infinite number of dimensions. A Hilbert space is an abstract vector space possessing the structure of an inner product that allows length and angle to be measured. Furthermore, Hilbert spaces must be complete, a property that stipulates the existence of enough limits in the space to allow the techniques of calculus to be used. Hilbert spaces arise naturally and frequently in mathematics, physics, and engineering, typically as infinite dimensional function spaces. The earliest Hilbert spaces were studied from this point of view in the first decade of the 20th century by David Hilbert, Erhard Schmidt, and Frigyes Rees. They are indispensable tools in the theories of partial differential equations, quantum mechanics, Fourier analysis which includes applications, to signal processing and heat transfer and ergodic theory, which forms the mathematical underpinning of thermodynamics. John von Neumann coined the term Hilbert space for the abstract concept that underlies many of these diverse applications. The success of Hilbert space methods ushered in a very fruitful era for functional analysis. Apart from the classical Euclidean spaces, examples of Hilbert spaces include spaces of square integrable functions, spaces of sequences, subway of spaces consisting of generalized functions, and Hardy spaces of holomorphic functions. Geometric intuition plays an important role in many aspects of Hilbert space theory. Exact analogues of the Pythagorean theorem and parallelogram law hold in a Hilbert space. At a deeper level, perpendicular projection onto a subspace the analog of dropping the altitude of a triangle plays a significant role in optimization problems and other aspects of the theory. An element of a Hilbert space can be uniquely specified by its coordinates with respect to a set of coordinate axes and orthonormal bases, in analogy with Cartesian coordinates in the plane. When that set of axes is countably infinite, this means that the Hilbert space can also usefully be thought of in terms of infinite sequences that are square summable. Linear operators on a Hilbert space are likewise fairly concrete objects, in good cases, they are simply transformations that stretch the space by different factors in mutually perpendicular directions in a sense that is made precise by the study of their spectrum.